Hi, this is Ian Mitchell with VTech Communications, and just wanted to quickly show you how to register our decked handsets to our SNOME M100 KLE base. And one of the other things that's great about this is we actually have cross compatibility between our VTech VDP650 series and our SNOME M100 KLE series. So we notice here we have the SNOME M100 decked base. We also have our SNOME M10R ruggedized handset along with a VTEC VDP651 handset, and then the SNOME M18 death set. So to begin the pairing process, we'll actually notice that out of the box, we actually support DECT auto registration. So as long as you program the DECT IPEI number onto your configuration, the handsets and death sets can actually auto register. But in this case, we're gonna do a manual registration. So we will actually just see on here where it says the, deck, uh, the auto reg didn't work. We'll go ahead and hit yes, that we wanna try manual. That'll reset the handset and put you into a manual mode. So at this point, we can actually just hold the page button for about four seconds on the base. And then we'll see that both the power and SIP light will flash in sync. And we just hit the pound key we can put the handset back, and that should auto-register. All right, so we have one handset registered, and at this point we can register some other devices. So same process for the desk set, let's say. Hold that page button for four seconds. Now that both line LEDs are flashing in sync, we'll just hit the pound key. All right now we can see we have the desk set registered. And if we want to do the same thing on our M10R, again, we notice that it is in the decked auto registration. We'll just hit the yes button to cancel out of that. It does a quick power, hands, uh, a quick power cycle of the handset and now we're in manual mode. So again, hold that page button. Both LEDs are flashing, hit pound, and put it back. Now one other thing that we'll notice is by default we're just going to say things like handset one, handset two, or desk set two, handset three. We can actually rename this. So as we can see here in the web UI, we'll go ahead and update our handset statuses. And we see we have three devices registered, um, two handsets and a desk set. And if we wanted to rename these, we would simply go into our system, down to handset name, and we could actually call these, let's say, floor, front desk, and warehouse. And we can see the update in the handset status here. And back at the front of our handsets and desk sets, we can see that our names have updated. So we have the front desk for our main desk phone. We also have the floor for our handset. And then we have the warehouse for the other handset. And that's how easy it is to register the decked phones and also give them a new name.